I'm like pacing. I see you are awake, Dalan. It is fortunate Duncan found you when he did. I know not what dark power held you, but it nearly bled the life from you. It was difficult even for my magic to keep you alive. Uh... Then Tamlin could be sick as well. If he encountered the same thing you did? Yes. The Grey Warden said he found you alone outside a cave, already stricken. Duncan thought there may have been darkspawn creatures inside the cave. Is that true? Um... All I remember was the mirror. There were walking corpses and other strange monsters. Walking corpses? Dark magic, but not darkspawn. I know not what the other creatures might It was like have a bear, been. but it wasn't! What else did you find? What is the last thing you remember? Um, a mirror. Tamlin touched it. A mirror? And it caused all this? I have never heard of such a thing in all the lore we have collected. Oh, I was hoping for answers when you woke, but there are only more I'm questions. Sorry. And Tamlin remains missing. He is more important than any lore in these ruins. If he is as sick as you were, his condition is grave. Duncan returned to the cave to search for Darkspawn, but we cannot rely on How him does to she look know for him? Tamlin as well. We must go ourselves, and quickly. Do you feel well enough to show us the way, Dalin? Without you, we will not find it. Um, I am up to it, Keeper. I feel fine. I am relieved to hear it. I am ordering the clan to pack the camp so we can go north. Meryl! Take Meryl with you to the cave. Find Tamlin if I you know can, that but name. do it swiftly. She is, that's Meryl is a girl. She is in Dragon Age 2. Oh my gosh. Um, why do you want me to take, no, okay, we need to get going. I, 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 it would be better to ask questions, I know, but, um, I don't, I think my character, she's a warrior, right? She's gonna, she's giving an order, she's gonna do it. She's gonna do the thing. Take Meryl to the cave and find Tamlin. Plus, she wants to freaking find Tamlin. I understand. Go quickly. For Tamlin's life, hang Yeah, they don't the have balance. time to be like, blah, 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 blah. Okay, uh, all right, well, okay, I have questions about this Grey Warden. When Tamlin's life is at stake? Oh, very well. I thought the Grey Wardens had disappeared. Not quite, Dalen. After they defeated the Darkspawn long ago, the Grey Wardens' numbers diminished greatly over the centuries. It seems the humans have little use for them if Darkspawn aren't actively raising their lands. I suppose the thought of Darkspawn returning one day did not occur to them. And have they returned? The Grey Warden thinks so. A war may be in the offing. If so, we must get as far away from it as possible. Um, could we not help in the battle? Let the humans fight their battles, as we must fight our own. Why did you believe anything the Shemlin said? He seemed honorable. Oh, you don't know Duncan. And his care for your safety speaks well of him. I trust my You'd judgment. You have to. Mm -hmm. How did he know where to bring me? He said he had been looking for our clan and had a hint of our whereabouts. As I said, you were fortunate. Wow. It is possible he sought a volunteer to join that uh, order. Dalish have joined these Grey Wardens before? Indeed. The Grey Wardens once consisted of the best from all races. I know of no Dalish joining them since the days of oh. the Darkspawn Wars, okay. however. What if he asks for one now? It would be a great honor, though I don't know why any Dalish would choose such a life. Regardless, he has not asked. Are these Wardens great warriors? They are the best and most noble of all races, Dalen. Few can achieve their standards. I have no more questions. Then do not tarry. Find Tamlin quickly. Ah, okay. Curious about Darkspawn? Remember that Tamlin needs Am I, your like, help. ruining this? Okay. Ah, I'm gonna check. Okay, uh, no.
Okay, it looks like we can ask questions without it having a horrible thing. Didn't the Grey Wardens destroy the Darkspawn long ago? They destroyed the last horde of Darkspawn to threaten the surface centuries ago. It doesn't mean they extinguished them all. Do you think this cave was a Darkspawn lair? Darkspawn are savage, uncultured creatures. More akin to locusts than men. They may have befouled the cave, but they did not build what is there. From the Warden's description, it may have been a temple devoted to an old god. Should we return, I may see it for myself. Why did he think I'd met a Grey or Darkspawn? Darkspawn are filthy, diseased beasts that taint the very air around them. The Grey Warden seemed to think your illness came from this town. How could you... Since you did not meet any Darkspawn, I don't see how that could be. No doubt he was mistaken. There was a demon, not a Darkspawn. What is a Darkspawn? Could that bear-like monster have been a Darkspawn? Hmm. The old tomes say Darkspawn come in as many varieties as surface creatures. They also say that many Darkspawn are seen only during what the humans call a blight. Perhaps your bear monster was one of those. What is a Darkspawn exactly? They are mostly boogeymen, used to frighten human children. In modern times, like, they yeah, are they're rarely seen on surface oh, they're just boogeymen. Just but rumor holds that great numbers dwell in the ancient tunnels of the Durganlan, the dwarves. They obliterate all that is in their path. Like a plague of locusts, they spread disease and misery when they come to the surface. An event to be feared, without doubt. If you hear chewing, I apologize. I'm starving to death. I have no more coins about a dodge bomb. Keep her. And do not tarry. Find Tamlin quickly. I like her. I need more equipment before Master I go. Master Island can help you. Island? Go to him and ask to see his stuff. Is that how you actually pronounce it? Goodbye, Keeper. We actually... Yeah, my uh, my second, what well, was going to be my second, Dalish elf character in Dragon Age Inquisition, I named him Elen. That's how I pronounced it. That's really interesting. I didn't realize that. I ended up sort of accidentally going for Talon instead, the character that I created first, and it was kind of confusing. But yeah, this is a different. This is not the uh, Marathari. Hmm. Oh my gosh, I keep wanting to say Ben Harrell. Darmisu. Small scroll. It's good to see you healthy. We feared you would perish. Thank you. Hmm. Pival. So you have returned to us, Dalen. We are grateful you are whole and well. Oh, they're so nice to me. I'm glad to be here as well, Haran. Oh, he's a elder. So you should be. <laughs> what were you two thinking? Wandering into that cave without first coming to tell the Keeper. We wanted to see if there was anything to tell, Hotren. Once you saw what was inside, you should have returned. But you kept exploring. You would have you? too! I suppose your youth can be forgiven. Sadly, Tamlin pays no! the price. No! Losing you would be a terrible crime, Dalen. You belong to more than just yourself. Or do you not remember? Um, I wanna. I actually don't know what he's talking about, unless he means I've, unless I'm like tied to the clan or whatever. You know, I like this. You belong to more than just yourself. Or do, am I like, am I like given to a god or something? I'll say, what do you mean? Let us tell these children of the fall of the Dales. You can honor me. By sharing in the telling. Certainly, Haren. Come then. Help me as I go along. I have children. Things to do. Hear of the fall of the Dales. Hear the tale of what makes you Dalish. Would you care to begin, Dalen? Well, children, it's up to the mommy and daddy out. <laughs> Long ago, we were slaves to the humans. Yes. Slaves to a terrible empire, the humans built on the darkest magic. When it fell, we became free. We built a homeland in the Dales, worshipping the creators and rebuilding the culture and history we lost in our long years of slavery. I don't think they really do that in Inquisition. Have you ever lost your bow? It was a lot like that. <laughs> But the humans wouldn't let us. They were resentful. Because we would not worship their gods. 
and because we put our people first. Over the years, their nations grew cold toward the Dales. In their eyes, we were blasphemers and cruel I have never tyrants. seen so many Elvish children, ever. There was only like two in the other Dalish camp. Wow, holy crap, look at these Dalish kids. Wow. But also great for festivals. <laughs> My gosh, the Dalish elf can be snarky. Then the humans declared war on the Dales. And so the Dales fell. They took our lands. These kids are like, and dispersed oh, shut our up. people, forcing us to live in their cities and abandon our gods. But many of us refused to relinquish our ways. We instead chose to scatter to the winds. Wandering the lands. It takes great strength to do that. We chose wandering the lands rather than the human rule. To survive and preserve our culture. The clans stay apart. Until the day the Elvenon have a homeland once more. We shall return to the old ways. We shall return the old ways to those who have lost them. We are the Dalish. Keepers of the lost lore. Walkers, Walkers of the lonely, the lonely path. We are the last Elevine, Elvenan. Never again shall we submit. Thank you for your forbearance, Dalen. Mm. You remember both the tale and the oath of the Dales perfectly. Okay, that's where it is. I will let you get back is. to your tasks. I pray you find Tamlin quickly. I would like to hear more about our history. Do elves ever live in caves? I've never heard of such a thing. But... In the days of ancient Arlathan, we lived free and spread far across the continent. We were as varied as the Shemlin, though fewer in number. Perhaps some of us lived in caves then, but all knowledge from that era is lost. I'd love to hear more about our history. Now that's something I rarely hear. Of course. Tell me about... Oh my gosh, this is awesome! I'm gonna find out all kinds of stuff. I really feel like my character would actually bolt out after Tamlin, but this is cool stuff. I want to figure it out. Tell me about Arlathan. Ah, yes. The Lost City. Before the Shemlin enslaved us, even before they came to this part of the world, our people lived in glorious Arlathan. Legends like say Arlathan that our ancestors were immortal, and we possessed magic the Shemlin could only dream of. The voice acting in this game is like Beyond fantastic. Do no books record our history? When the humans enslaved us, they took away our language, so our history, and our immortality. Take away their culture. We quickened to the pace of life and retained nothing of ourselves. His eyes are we gorgeous. We were slaves for so long that even when we became free, there was little for us to recover. If books still exist, I do not know of them. Um, what happened to the elves who didn't join the Dalish? They remain in human cities, forgetting all they once had. We call them flat ears. Not very nice. But they differ little from their Shemlin masters. A few may return. But we must accept that they know nothing of the lore, or why we keep it. Why do the humans, why do the Shems allow us to exist if they hate us so much? Perhaps they have no choice. Dalish clans are scattered to the winds and rarely gather which makes us difficult for any organized effort to destroy. And why bother? We have nothing they want. No land, no treasure. And we always move on, allowing no one to grow too angry with us. Some might see this as cowardly, but we are proud. We are the last, and we will survive. Last of, last of the elven on. Uh, so, uh, your character in Inquisition, actually, when you go visit the Dales for the first time, and the scoutmaster talks to you, you actually have a special option to say, to recite that oath. And I didn't really know where, I thought it was just an oath, like something from a story, but apparently it's the oath of the Dales that the elves took. So that's really cool, I didn't realize that. Um, I don't think it's cowardly, they just, they, they are survivalists. Like they are, they have their own pride and dignity and they know they need to survive to keep what little of their culture they have alive. Having them separated doesn't seem like a very good idea culturally. 
like to keep everything organized and together, you know, like all the information or whatever. But for survival purposes, it's great. They can't they can't do an exalted march on nothing, you know, on scattered tribes, you know. It wouldn't be practical. And in Inquisition, anyway, they say that your tribe, sometimes the tribes tend to, or the clans tend to roam the borders of the free marches, uh, like city-state things. Um, so, because then, because if anybody, you know, if anybody tries to attack them, the neighbor will be like, what, you're trying to attack us? You know, and so it's supposed to be a fairly safe place, but they tend to just kind of wander where nobody will, will, will mind. Um... Wow, I'm learning a lot. This is cool. Think, do you think we'll ever find another homeland? We can hope to find a new home one day. Where the Dalish and the Flat Ears will build a land ah, greater even than then. Arlathan. We shall teach the Flat Ears the lore they lost. And perhaps they will teach us to understand the Shemlin ah. at last. That is the only way we shall truly live in peace. This man seems very wise. If he's, if he's willing to see that, you know what I mean? Like, you know, like, it's not just, like, we're being separate. Only the Dalish will do. It's, hey, like, we can all learn something from each other, you know? That's all. Then Thank I'm you. sure you have much to do. Unless you've other questions. I do. What do you know about that Grey Warden? The one who brought you back? Very little. He seemed decent enough, as humans go. The Elders seem as to like Grey him. As for Grey Wardens, they're heroes without a doubt. Members of our own clan joined their ranks in ages oh, past. Oh, really? Wow, of the of our own clan. That's really cool. What do you know about the Darkspawn? Only that they eat living flesh Bleh. and lurk in underground tunnels, once ruled by the Dergenlen, Dergenlen, the dwarves. In the last blight long ago, the Grey Wardens all but wiped them out. Should they return, all races will shudder. And there's nowhere we could run to escape it. I should go. Of course. May the gods guide your path, Dalen. And you, Dalen. I think it's Dalen for boy and girl. Meow. Why can't I open that? Meow. No, I cannot. No, I cannot. Don't be snarky with me. Elf woman. I'm glad you survived. Losing two of our young would be a great blow to the clan. I I'm pretty sure you're young, too. Why is there so much locked stuff? I hear the holla. They freaking sound like goats. There they are. They're gorgeous. I don't think they need to put them in a paddock of any sort. Pretty sure the Hala are free to come and go. Eldest of the sun. Elgarnan. Elf woman. Elf hunter. How could Tamlin be lost? He knows this area well. Uh, Maren. Anathara. It's good to see you recovered. How are the Hala faring, Marin? They fare well. The Keeper called for the clan to move on, and they will be ready to take us. One is heavy with calf, but it shouldn't be a problem. May I ask of Tamlin's fate? Some say the clan Never. will leave Never! The Keeper we wouldn't let that him. happen. I won't allow that to happen. The Hala mourn our fallen. No sound is more heart-wrenching than their mourning cry. At least they won't be crying over you. They are quite fond of you. <laughs> The Hala are beautiful creatures. I admire them for their strength and pride. They are equals, not servants like the Shemlin horses. At any rate, I do not envy the Keeper's decision. I'll pray for Tamlin's safe return. Me too! Even as I wander, Gillenane. Hello, friends! You are the most beautiful things I have ever seen. You're the most beautiful creatures ever. You're even prettier than the dragons in Inquisition. Small wooden crate. Oh, I just picked up a codex entry. Um, oh, Hunter. Elin! I'm glad you've recovered. Once we find Tamlin, we can concentrate on the journey northward. Thank you for the bow, Master Island. It Island. is light and sturdy. Much better than the one I made last year. You are more than welcome. My father made it and used it in battle against the Clan tribes. I will carry it with honor. Wow. Could I ask you for a bow as well? 
Or no, I kind of want to say, I would like to hear the story of your father's battle. Yeah, because I don't need a bow. Then I am proud to tell it. Our clan was one of the first to flee the Dales. When we came to Ferelden, the fiercest of the Shimlin were the barbarians known as the Clane. We didn't I wait for them to them. attack us. Every Dalish clan in Ferelden united to bring the battle to them. There are more Dalish clans in Ferelden? In Ferelden, in Orle, wherever there are lands the humans cannot hold, we bring our Aravels. You met some at the last gathering. Oh my gosh, it's so the cool! It's so cool! Well that day, we carved out our reputation of being the deadliest archers. Our arrows won us the right to wander these woods at will. It was this very bow that my father used that day. Thank you for the tale, Master Island, and especially the bow. I will honor it. Yeah, why would you give that away? Why would you relinquish such a relic? We are all the same clan. His hand is as my hand. I have relinquished uh, nothing. Okay, I see. It was my father who first spoke of the Vir Tanadal, the three ways of the hunter. The first is the Vir Asan, the way of the arrow, to reach for our goal unrelenting. The second is the Vir Borasan, the way of the bow, to bend, but not to break. The last is the Vir Adelen, the way of the wood. We are as ancient as the forests, each tree a part of the greater land. All Dalish are united in this. One day, this we shall have a homeland again. This is awesome! Could I ask you for a bow as well? I'll try. One of my own crafting, perhaps? Yes, thank you. Woo! He does not need much persuasion, apparently. Should I have been an archer? It may not have a history, but you'll provide one for it soon enough, yes? I think I can use a bow, though, as a... I can, can't I? Yeah. I can't. I didn't think about that. Um, may I see your crafts, Master? But the father above the battle, that you, how old was your dad? You know what I mean? May I see your crafts? Of course. Take whatever you need. Like, can I just take it? Or, um... Rapid aim, damage five. Um, I'll sell two of those, I guess. I have a clan shield. I'll sell that. Um, I have that. I mean, really. I could sell that, I think, technically. Oh, I need to put that on. Um, oh, I can use that trap? That's interesting. Uh, okay. Thank you. Let me actually, um, remember. Dalish leather belt. Okay. Hala hide embossed with images of birds of flight. Perfect. Wait, oh. Yeah, all r all rough. Uh, a, and then I have Darmisu in both hands. Yeah, I get I can get rid of one of the great swords at least. I should I guess. Um, oh, this is my secondary weapon. Oh my! Oh my gosh! I didn't realize I was on my secondary weapon set. Okay, dokey. I am gonna trade it out because this one has rapid shot and I'll equip fire arrow. Okay, maybe I'll play with the bow a bit. Okay. I didn't even think about it. Have you fully recovered? I heard the keeper was confounded. That she had never seen anything like it. I can't be blight. I couldn't have been blight sick. You know? There's no cure for that. Oh, you guys have names. Junar and Paul. Ah, it's good you're well. You weren't here when Paul arrived, were you? I've heard of you. 
Everyone is talking about you and the other missing hunter. Are you, uh, Sidious? great Sidious? warden brought you back here. Um. Yeah, you're not Dalish. Uh, you don't have any face, face markings either. You're not Dalish, are you? That's not, that's not nice to say. Uh, the hunter's name is Tanlin, or should I say, do you... Seems more natural to say, do you know about the Grey Wardens? Or, no, let me say... Do you know about the Grey Only Wardens? Only from stories I heard back in the alienage in Denerim. Paul's a flat air. He arrived here a few days ago from the human lands. I heard rumors in a nearby human village that a Dalish camp was close, and I hoped to find your hunters in the forest. You were fortunate I didn't shoot you, Paul. I thought you were a shem, and a bandit at that. You're not the first city elf to rejoin his people. I'm sure he'll find life among us more satisfying than with the Shems, if no less harsh. In the alienage, we hear terrible stories about the Dalish. They aren't true, right? Uh, no. Only the parts we sacrifice young elves to the gods. You've got nothing to worry about, Paul. Thank you. The clan has been very kind and welcoming. I never expected it to be like this. We are a good clan. Okay. Good, good. We are nice. He's teaching him the ways. Why would the Keeper call for a move so early? We were not expecting to leave for weeks. Well, you know, stuff happened. Fen not Fen her elf I think I've looked at everything I can. Is the Keeper sending you back to that cave to look for Tamlin? He's handsome too. Um, yes, I'm going with Meryl. I want to go with you. Keeper Marathari probably won't approve, but I can help find Tamlin. Um, okay, I mean, the more the merrier. I don't know why not. All right, come with us. Good. I'll follow you, just to make sure Meryl doesn't go running to the Keeper when you tell her I'm coming. Oh, is this sneaky? Oh, okay. I don't, oh, maybe that was a bad idea. Uh, oh, hang on. Do you have, uh, rogue abilities? Nope. Okay. Where's this Meryl? Let's see. Oh, a shawl, child. Locked chest everywhere. That's so unfair. By the creators, it is so good to see you whole and well. I was so worried. Uh, Anath Ara Ashal, it's good to see you too. All that time you were ill, the Keeper didn't know if you were going to live or die. Are you my die. mom? I've been outside the Keeper's tent the whole time. I have never been so relieved as when I heard you Everybody were Everybody is through. so nice what to happened? me! Everyone says Tamlin may be dead. He's missing, that's all we know right now. That's awful. He's been a good friend to you since you were fledglings. You must be more careful. Your mother and father, may they rest in peace, would be horrified to see you take such risks. So you were my mother figure. You've never spoken of my parents much, Ashal. Ashal, eh? What happened to them is a sad tale, and it's in the past. Reopening old wounds benefits no one. Persuade, don't we Dela strive to learn of our past? You've much to do tonight, with no! Tamlin still missing. No! I will tell you another time. No, my persuasion is not high enough. Why do we have to leave again? We're always going somewhere. Why can't I go to the Shem City? <laughs> Don't be asking questions like that, kiddo. Okay. Uh, uh, Hunter. Have you fully recovered? I heard the keeper nope. was confounded. Aravels! Meryl, I see you. Meryl! The keeper told me I'm to accompany you back to those caves. As her apprentice, I may see something you missed. But our main objective is to find Tamlin, of course. We must make haste. He may not have much time. How much of our lore do you know? Less than I'd like to. I know some of our old magic, as the Keeper does, and I'll know about these relics if I see them. The Keeper isn't sending me to collect anything, however. We're worried about Tamlin. Yeah! Are you worried about getting sick? A little, but the Keeper cured you. How dangerous could it be? Even if ah. I get sick, finding Tamlin or something valuable will be worth it. Um, 
How much did the keeper tell Enough you? Enough to pique my interest and my concern. You can explain the rest on the way. Uh, I need supplies? Master Island could help you, but do not tarry. Okay. I don't need supplies. You're back. Are you ready to go now? Yeah. Uh, uh Feneral is coming with us. Any objections? That depends on the keeper. I thought we're supposed to go alone. Um... Oh, okay, maybe we are. Okay, you stay here. Fine. I don't want to get you in trouble. Yeah. I should be on guard duty anyhow. Okay, so good. So that's settled. Are you ready to go? Okay. I don't want to get anybody in trouble. Okay, let's head out now. And let us make haste while daylight lasts. Woo! I should... I, you can't tell. I'm like piecing... I'm gonna be like piecing these together into one big thing um but i'll probably call this one here so my so my audio recording doesn't like explode somehow for some reason but looks like everything is working pretty well on the video recording which makes me happy um but yeah i really i'm re i like lynn i quite i'm getting quite used to seeing her running around on the screen so this is really cool uh and the dalish intro is so engaging i quite enjoy it so um anyway thank you guys for sharing this with me. If I end up sharing it with you, it's going to be great. Uh, um, thanks again. I'll see you in the next one.